Another completely redesigned line from us, the new BNS. BNS starts from the ground up with a complete redesign. The idea, lighter weight, better fit, less part numbers. We have two part numbers now. Um, you have an extra small through medium and a large XL. The idea behind this is now you can bring in two braces. You can cover every single customer instead of having to bring in all five individual sizes before. To do your size adjustments, two bolts in the upper, two bolts in your chest plate. With this design, you can actually take your coupler out, put a different length, uh, different chest depth in there. So this comes as a large, large XL. You pull this plate out, you pop an XL plate in. If your extra small through medium comes set as a medium, you have a small and an extra small plate in the box. Once you have your major chest depth size adjustment done, you have the incremental adjustments. Two chest pads, two shoulder pads, four back pads. For me, it fits me pretty good right out of the box. I do have a little bit of room against my shoulders on the top two pads. In the packaging, there's a secondary set of 10 millimeter pads. Everything on here is a five mil. So all I would have to do is take two 10 millimeter pads, place them here in the back, in the back plate, and that'll flush it up against my shoulders. Outside of the fit, there's obviously a lot of technical changes. Big thing's the weight. You have a 25% drop in weight from the previous carbon in your pro version. In your tech, which is our carbon version, you have a 33% drop in weight from the last model. Dramatic, dramatic decrease in weight. It's also gonna have some cool new features. Obviously your torsion bars, they're increased. Um, they're designed to take multiple impacts in an accident now. The old design was uh, built purposely to absorb that first major impact and under the right amount of load, break away and take the stress off your shoulders. With this design, we actually had a lot of key input from riders like Justin Barsha. If you watch Barsha, Barsha rips, but when Barsha crashes, Barsha crashes pretty hard. Um, so Barsha wanted a piece that can actually maintain the consistency of protection through three, four, five multiple hits in a crash. He wanted something that will continually absorb. We've also added some flexibility to the chest plate. So in your chest here, you actually get ripped panels underneath and it takes pressure off the sternum in an impact. What we've seen in the past is although we have dispersion points in the shoulders and the back plate, we've always seen a lot of pressure come into the sternum. See some bruising, um, this is where most of the impact is absorbed. With your new model, it actually flexes away from the sternum in a crash. So if it pushes down here, it pulls away from the chest. It's a, it's a fourth energy dispersion zone now, and it'll also help eliminate mass amounts of energy through your different impact areas. So now the idea is instead of four, or I'm sorry, instead of three points, you have four points. So this is flushing some of the extra energy that was before going to these three points. Um, obviously the lighter weight, and I believe lower pricing, because wasn't the original carbon 399 Kent? Yes. So now you're looking at 350 for your carbon brace, and you're looking at 289 for your pro version, the, uh, the special blend. The last little feature that I didn't touch on, but you guys will all notice it when I'm passing it around, is that dual stage locking magnet system. All you do is you pull the tab directly out, opens it up. There's two different magnets that lock in there. There's also a dual lift closure that locks in there as well. So one, it's not the boot buckle anymore. It's really good for the rider that's always late to the moto, last guy at the gate still putting his gear on. Now all he has to do is throw it over, snap it closed, and he's ready to go. It's also really good for the rider that crashes a lot. EMT, someone has to come around and pull a brace off him. They don't have to go for that emergency plate on the old brace anymore. They can pop that tab right open. It's a non-pressure pull system, so it's not going to move the neck around.